The Weed of the Week is sponsored by Ag PhD Summer Field Day 2012, July 27th at the Hefty Farm in Baltic, South Dakota. For more information, go to agphd.com. Our Weed of the Week is crabgrass. It's a warm season annual grass. How are we gonna control it? That's one of the things we had trouble with in lawns this year is that some of the perennials that were cool season grasses really went into dormancy early and the warm season grasses like crabgrass just had a great year. You know, when you see crabgrass out in your lawn, you think, man, I gotta get rid of that stuff, but the best time to do it is actually before that crabgrass is up. We like to spray real early in the spring. This year, it was about three or four weeks earlier than we normally do, but typically when the lilacs are blooming, that's about the right time to apply your crabgrass prevention. So the product we'll use on our farm is Drive, but Dimension and other products are also out there that are very good as well. The main thing is just to make sure you're spraying and spraying timely. If you're spraying too early, if you're spraying, let's say a month earlier than the crabgrass is gonna show up, a lot of times you don't have enough residual left when the crabgrass actually does show up. Also products like Drive have some activity in terms of burn down. So if a little bit of the crabgrass is started and you hit it at that early stage, you can get burned down there, plus leave yourself residual for later season control. That's all time we have for our Weed of the Week crabgrass, but there's more Ag PhD to come after this.